Greetings, my pups is your Alpha Bull here, and today I'm gonna be playing some more Outlast. Now, I did try recording this once before, I, as me and myself, with the Whistleblower DLC, but with 10 minutes in, the entire neighborhood, plus a few blocks over, plus about a five minute drive from my house, the power died for like an hour. And it sucked. But we'll see if I can, you know, within the first ten minutes, try to get my uh, first reactions down again. Hopefully, maybe. Now, uh, this game will actually be somewhat inappropriate for a lot of my viewers because I know there are a lot of children that watch my channel, but I'll do my absolute best to keep this as censored as possible. Open those eyes. You don't have to wake up, but open your eyes. What's the matter? Did somebody hit you? Here. Let me help you. Ow. That's grody. You getting these alerts? Kind of busy here. It sounds like real trouble. At the engine, they said Hope made a lateral ascension. Maybe Hope. You're not happy about it? No. <laughs> Come on. So what's up with this Rorschach thing? Two hours earlier. You don't know me. I have to make this quick. That might be monitoring. I did two weeks of software consults and Murkoff psychiatry system facilities in Mountain Mass. I've also done NDA. Blah, blah, blah. They've paged for you three times already. There's something urgent at the engine. Wait, wait, Mark. What are you doing in here anyway? I thought you were just a software guy. Turn back down to 190. Parts per million, yeah, but those are precursors to precursors. I'm worried about wait, losing it by a Somebody is bad. Doctor was predicting assembly by 150. We're not being given enough information to trust Renegade's prediction. Alright. You're wailing at Mark, aren't you? Why weren't you answering the page? I was busy. Get out of the way. Meep, 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 meep. Ah, the store. Okay. Meep. That sounds alright. I didn't think I'd miss her this much. Christ, Waylon, hurry up. Yeah, shut up. It's a big door. Ah, cutting it close. Next patient is coming in arterial spin. I got Galuskin out of his cell. Park. Finally. Where have you been? Functional imaging in faces and talking to the ASL. We got a patient 30 seconds out and we're blind inside his head. Call into the chamber. Ask them to delay. We got you. I don't need another performance evaluation. Mr. Park here is going to have us up and running before we even know it. Right, Mr. Park? We got a couple of errors. That's not good. Are Something's offline. No. Uh, Steve? FMRI is still dark. You're doubting our friend, Mr. Wayland Park? Which I consider more than unkind to his programming skill and considerable dedication to the Burnout Corporation. Fuck me, they're bringing him in. Don't let them... You! I know you can stop this! 
You have to help me. You have to. Hey, calm yourself. This hey. is a high security. Hey. It's all right, Agent. Mr. Park was just surprised. I'm sure he's still calm and eager to finish his work. Take your seat. Quickly, Mr. Park. It will need to roll if the fusion monitoring is not active when we put him in the engine. Five seconds. Four. Three. There's a lot of tubes in his throat. Positioning imaging player. You're finished, Mr. Uh, Park. Ew. And leave. That's pretty grody. That doesn't sound good at all ever. That's grody. Anyways. Yeah, shut up. I don't wanna work at this pace. I wouldn't want to work anywhere like this. I mean, there's a lot of negativity here. There's a lot of negativity in my life. <sighs> I left this open. Like, all the way. Oh, the class. Ow, that's kind of laggy. Are you laggy? Ow. Mr. Whalen Park, consulting contract 8208. Software engineer with a level three security clearance. Graduated cum laude from Berkeley, but still somehow not smart enough to realize that the last thing a fly ought to do in a spider's web is wiggle. Somehow dumb enough think that a borrowed laptop, onion router, and firewall patch would be enough to fool the world's leading supplier of biometric security. Stupid, Mr. Park. More than stupid. In fact, that was crazy. I'm afraid we're going to have to have you committed. Mr. Park, will you willingly submit to forced confinement? No. Did you hear that, Agent? He said yes, Mr. Blair. Hey. Great. Oh, and... Uh, did I just hear Mr. Wayland Park volunteer for the Morphogenic Engine Program? No. I heard, Mr. Blair. That was brave indeed, Wayland. The Murkoff Corporation and the Onward March of Science both appreciate your bravery and sacrifice. Maybe you could administer Mr. Park here a light anesthetic. Gladly. It's not a light anesthetic. That's a fist to my face. Alright, we're almost p about where my power went out, and I hope it doesn't do it again, because I would freaking suck. Well then. How would that do anything? Like, it, what does it do? Ow. No, I don't want to see him that early. No, 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 no. That doesn't sound good ever. Give me the camera. Oh, God. It's. Yeah. No god. Ow. No. I don't need to see that ghost this early in the game. That would friggin' suck. Wallflower. Pretty flower. I'll open you up. I'll open you up and show you. You wait right there. No. in here. Oh, hey, battery. Nice.
They're all staring at me. Guten Bacht. Alright. What's in here? Oh, God! Grody. Battery. I don't want to go in there because I think I'm naked man walking in there. Okay then. Our peeping town. Come to join our therapy session. Here, take the blade. Keep around with our friend here. Get a little red on your hands. It's always healthy to express yourself. You keep it bottled up too long and you might do something you regret. Too good for the likes of us. Think you're different? Something special? There are no observers here. Now, get the f out of here before I change my mind. Okay. Well then. Oh God. Here. Leave me alone! Hello. Oh god. Hey, look at that. Got it, okay. So, from that room of the dude stabby chesting. We get out of here through reception and then Merc Tactical clean it up. If they get here in time, we need help now. If we get them on the radio, the National Guard could be here with it. We don't even know if the radio works. It's shortwave. If the prison's got electricity, they've got signal. And the lights are on. Murkoff has under control. Yeah, I noticed. We need to get to that radio. Outside help doesn't come without outside attention. You want responsibility for every legally shaky thing you did on the Murkoff company payroll? I know I don't. It's too late to worry about that. This just has to stop. All right. You're scared. You're not thinking straight. Let me make something clear. You try to radio outside for help. I'm gonna give you a whole new something to be scared of. Well, that sucks. Yes. Well, like I said, everything past the stabby chest guy I've not seen, so we're good. Just glad to know that I wasn't too far. <coughs> Could you be any noisier? What is this stuff? Hello. He's dead or not. It's a little off on your uh, textures, guys. Just a little bit off. Help me, please. I'm a 
doctor. I need to get hold of my... You're not security. I was... I'm a patient like you. Stole these clothes from a dead body I found. You gotta get me out of here. Please, just push the button. Open the door. We can get out of here together. No! No! Well then. Beep. This probably means I'm supposed to hide if there's a locker in here. I don't know. No. No! God dang it. Hmm. Okay, so you can't hide from him. What the crap am I supposed to do? Try on the left locker. Goodbye. No. I work. Okay, well, there's the outside. So that's not going to happen. That's not going to happen. Hey. Thing. <clears throat> Miss Grant. You may receive requests for information for Mrs. Lisa Park of Leadville, Colorado. In the coming weeks concerning the resignation of and hospitalization of her husband Waylon, if so, please forward them to my personal attention. <sighs> yeah. Waylon Park, former consultant, contract 8208, resigned due to previously undiagnosed mental illness. I personally visited Mrs. Lisa Park and her sons broke the news to them with a silver lining that Marco's psychiatric would be graceful, graciously providing treatment. Mrs. Park had some less than charitable things to say about myself and the Markov Corporation. I assured her that the, her power of attorney, she could try to fight the doctor's diagnosis of her husband's illness. However, if it were discovered that he resigned under false pretenses, his insurance would be canceled and the family would would be saddled with not insignificant health care debts. Hopefully she understood, but if the, she insists on making a nuisance of herself or tries to get around me, please let me know. This is one I want to take care of personally. Yours, Jeremy Blair. Well, now I know that I want to beat the crap out of Jeremy Blair. Alright. Well, ew. Oh, that didn't work. 
Alright, well, I'm stuck, and this is a good place to stop anyways. So, thank you guys for watching. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. Be sure to leave a like and favorite. Uh, like I said, I'll do my best to keep this as sensitive as possible. And again, you guys have a nice day. Bye-bye.